Turns on again. Oh, there's a double hook up one at the back. Ooh. I don't know which way to look. Every time I turn around, the kids are catching the fish. Shark, look at that. Shark's on your fish, shark's on your fish. Look at the shark. Oh my god. Holy oh, dooly. <laughs> this is pulling drag. Look at the shark. Oh, oh my G'day, my name is Luke and this is my wife Jen and here are our two growing boys Liam and Elliot. We've been fishing, boating and exploring the pristine waters of the Fraser Coast for about 10 years now. So subscribe and come join the adventure. Hey ladies and gents, good morning. The family is a bit shell-shocked this morning because well, Liam's catching fish, so he's happy now. Elliot's about to jump into it. Had them up at 4.30, on the water by 5.30. Magic run out, and look at that right now. Oh, sunrise over Fraser Island. Excuse me while I'm trying to sort out my other GoPro here. Can I take here. a picture with you look here? So the goal today is quite simple, ladies and gents. For the boys to catch some fish, then we're gonna go for a bit of a spin and see if we can see a whale or three. And then we're gonna go for a bit more of a spin in close to the island, find a creek that we haven't visited in a while, have a bit of an explore, a bit of a paddle board, all that sort of stuff. And then uh, get home by about lunchtime and probably have a nana nap in the afternoon. So Liam's already ticked the fish off. Elliot, you don't need to get a rod out, mate. They're all up the back. So now we'll get Elliot onto one, and uh, hopefully it'll be a really good morning. Oh, it is a good morning. It's awesome. Coffee, guys. Is everybody still shell shocked or what? It's awesome. I think the coffee's kicked in now. <laughs> the coffee's kicked in. Hook. Don't go too hard, mate. Loosen the drag a touch. Okay. 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 You okay. 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 You understand? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, go, Elliot. Oh. It came off. Drop it straight back down, buddy. Keep going, oh, Look at that oh, sunset. Oh, that's, no, that's the problem. The three pinkies to Liam, is that right? All right. I reckon three pinkies. Oh, here we go. Like Liam's, Liam's getting excited. We're on Pinky Central, I think. Pinky and Benito Central. I haven't even got to the mark yet. We're still 100 meters short. I'm yeah, let it go to the bottom and then just do little hops, okay? Oh, Liam's on. That feels like a Benito, I'd say. Yep, Liam's got a bonito. Oh. <laughs> Am I just the processing dude in the middle? Yeah, I think. Alright. You got a pinky! Oh, I think you've got a bonito. You've got a bonito. Oh, it's a competition. It's a competition of which species we can get. <laughs> just just hold it there for a second, I'll be there and just. Liam, I hope you keep it count. Three. I'll tell you the secret to get the bonito. Bring your lure up a bit quicker. Okay, step back so I can get to the rod tip. Do you want a photo with it? It's got teeth. I'm not holding it. Whoa, that's a good pinky. You could take that one home and eat it if you wanted. A cat would love you if you did that. You having a go as well, do you? Yes, finally. I finally have a go. You finally managed to get a rod off the boys. See if Jen can get onto a fish as well. How good is this? We got the sun. Look at the sun. Takes a while. Oh, There's little single hop sites on the bottom, dear. Just sort of rise it up and then let it drop back down again. Liam's on again. Oh, that's a bit better, Liam. Could be a bonito, that one. Oh, I think Jen's on too. Very big. Let your drag loose a bit. Mum's okay. got it. Elliot's taking care of it. Thanks. Oh, this is why you it's all them. good. It's just crazy. They're just catching yeah. fish. I've got about back, five back forth, back forth. There you go. Fish. Okay. What do you reckon you got? Did you just oh, lose no, it? It's on, it's on. Oh, that's a pinky. Pinky. What do you got? A pinky? I can get it in. Yeah, I reckon you need to learn how to get it in. 
Right, Elliot? Yeah, definitely. I reckon you're right. Oh, look at all the Benito coming up with him. Holy! Yeah, yeah, well done. Seems some of them out there. All right, I'll get the... Uh, Why is he? Get the pole. Do they hurt? Yeah, they will hurt if they bite, if you bite them. Oh, idiot. Oh, there's a double hook up one at the back. Ooh, look at me. Fish. Another one? More fish. More fish. I don't know which way to look. Every time I turn around, <laughs> the kids are catching a fish. Liam's on again. What do you got, Liam? I don't know. Something. Little pinky, I think. Oh, Elliot seems to be nailing the bonito. All right, so this just goes to show you, folks, you don't need to catch the biggest fish in the world to have fun. Is this lots of fun, boys? Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah, we're excited to get up Lots early. of pinkies, lots of bonito. Yeah, I don't think everybody was excited no, to go up at 4.30, were they? Yeah. They I were don't talking know. about it yesterday. There's a lot of whinging. Mr. Mutton Bird's happy. You promised it would be worth it. It is worth it. And it's delivered. You delivered? You got a lamb? How many fish have you caught? Both of you. So oh, we're trying to cut... About seven, seven. 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 It's seven o'clock in the morning. So the boys are just using the same gear I was using yesterday, folks. They're 40 gram jigs. Um, I have upped the leader a little bit after I lost that fish yesterday. So just let it go to the bottom, boys. Remember, get to the bottom, couple of hops. If you don't get the pinkies on by then, start bringing it up through the water column and that's when the bonitos start striking. That was off the bottom. So that's a pinky, you can tell by the rod tip, the way that rod tip's going. That's a pinky. Elliot's trying for the bonito, he's coming up. He's on. He brought it up and now he's on. Now one thing we've had to do folks, and we'll flash a photo up of tragedy of a spider web creation that the boys created when they were both fishing on the same side. So you've noticed now we have them separated. We didn't film that. No, because I was... Why didn't we film it? I was losing my nana. I was... I was cursing about why I would bother coming out here early in the morning. I was losing my nana. He was a very calm parent. Yeah, yeah. Really calm. <laughs> it's just a photo. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, so yeah, one of, one of the things that people have to learn when they're on the boat together is line management. Uh, especially because the line isn't going straight down, it is moving around a bit. Shark, look at that. Shark's on your fish, shark's on your fish. Look at the shark, oh my god. Holy dooly. Holy dooly. going to chase yours. I'm on that. Quick, quick, quick. fish myself. Kids are having so much fun. I gotta land at least one one creature from out of the water. That's all I need. That's the smallest creature. What have you got Elliot? I don't know, maybe not. No. What have you got? Oh you got a grinner. Oh no this is different. I think this feels mackerel y Oi, this is different. Baby Trevally, I think. Is this, this is pulling drag. I think that's a yeah, baby Trevally. Oh, no, that's got little spots on it. What's that? It is. Like, oh, I'm really trying to concentrate on this, okay? Let's take it off, Elliot. Where are the flies? We've got three. Where are the flies? Triple hookups. You know, it's asking. I'm pretty sure if I had a right. Yeah, that's baby Trevally. When you get a triple hookup. Well, that's a baby Trevally. 
snapper. Yeah, that's a baby snapper. Oh, there you go. That's your new species, snapper. This is big. Just keep your lines up. This is a this is a good fish. Now unless he's foul hooked. Yep, the net's under the under the hatch. Elliot, can you back away mate? I think this is a mackerel, the way it's coming up. Look at it, it's coming up to the surface. Yeah, can you get off the hatch, please? Thank you. Look at that, it's coming right up to the surface. Can you see it? What is it? I reckon this is a mackerel. This is what's been chasing the others around. I'll be, if I can get the mackerel in on this light jigging gear, that'll be a miracle. Really? Yeah, because they'll bite straight through most things. So I need to be ready to net. Just. I'm going pretty light on him because he's um G'day everybody, I hope you're enjoying this video. If you are, please hit that thumbs up button. It really, really helps us out. Now I just want to let you know this battle is epic. It goes for about 50 minutes okay this fish runs me all over the boat it has me climbing over paddle boards it has me bent over it does all sorts of things and I know some people won't want to watch a full 15 minute of fighting a fish that's perfectly okay skip ahead to the 25 minute mark and you'll see the wrap up of what actually happens there's some pretty specky stuff there and then we'll get on to the rest of the video but for those hardcore fish shows out there the full 15, 17 minute battle is pretty, pretty cool. You get to see me puffing like crazy. That samurai extractor gets completely bent over. And there's some pretty, pretty interesting stuff that happens near the end of the fight. So keep watching, hit the thumbs up button, and I'll see you on the other side. Yeah, but there's a difference between lots of leverage and I'm going to have to just tire him out and hope that nothing fails in the meantime. See, he's coming up again. Yeah. How much line's still left? Oh, plenty of line. He's not too far away. No, no, that's what I mean. Sorry, yeah. How much? Could be a tuna. See how it's thumping? The tuna or a golden. Or maybe it's a giant golden. Watch where that net is, dear. He's doing circles, I think, so could be. Would you catch that here? Nah. I just want to see colour. Give me colour. Okay, I'm coming back up to the front. It's probably best you all just stay down the back for the moment. Who would you like to net? Liam or me? Whoever's not going to stuff it up. Who's most likely to not... I'll face the music if I stuff it up. So you don't get yelled at, Liam. Having trouble? I can't get leverage on him. So this is going to be a prolonged fight. Now normally I'd use the electric to get above him. But I can't get down to my electric. Do you want me to get it? No. Just it's just So I'm just I'm running lighter drag in the hope that there's no sharks around and that I don't pull anything. Suspect when he sees the boat again. If he sees the boat, he's a 
My feeling is go real slow and gentle until I see it because I don't want to lose it because I've lost every good fish. I don't want to jinx myself either by talking. Okay, coming down this way. Oh, I'm about to be in all sorts of trouble with that paddleboard. Stay away from a mutton bird. It's coming right up to the surface now. Right in those spots. Yeah, they always do this. You can pass it to me if you need. No. <laughs> Whoever's move seriously move <laughs> circling like a like a tuna like a trevally Definitely got a bit of size about it. Yeah, that's it's now going out there. Saw the boat. Yeah. In our competent camera crew, mm -hmm. I can see colour, would have the other camera on the pole that's under there, under the water. No, it is. leave flashing. it. Better be on. Tell me when I need to get close. Oh, it's going under the boat. Out the way. Oh dear. It's under. Don't go around that electric motor. I need the electric motor to come up. Yeah, bring the electric motor up. Do you know how to do it? No, 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 no. Up here? On their remote. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Just hang on. He's not too far away. Get the camera ready. Concentrate on that. Saw colour. Silver. I can't get him up. I can't get him up. Okay, that's the Please don't bash the boat. trying to get back to that structure. <laughs> this is just a matter of tiring him out at the moment. Yep. Oh, this is an epic fight. Oh, 
It's coming up again. Well, I'm going a little bit lighter because I've I've lost big fish lately. Yeah. So I'm just yeah. trying to tire him out. And at the moment, he's circling to get air into his gills. He's still got, every time he comes near the boat. Like he's not getting a free ride. I'm thumbing this spool pretty hard. I reckon it might be it. I reckon it might be a tuner, eh? See, when it gets close, if it's not ready for the drive, you won't mind around. Maybe I'll be fine. Okay, so we've turned the electric motor off to drift off. Just because he's getting in some weird angles. I don't have a lot of leverage on him. So at the moment I'm thinking tuna or trevally. Trevally do have a habit of going on their side and really making it hard to pull them up. Like the fish only might be a couple of kilos because he's on his side. He's, he's pulling all that water with him. So you're effectively like more and more kilos to try and pull up and I'm this one I deliberately set up quite light I have seen color but I couldn't quite make it out it's going back down he's not he's not coming easy let's put it that way Big bonito, you reckon, Elliot? Really? Yeah. <laughs> if it's a bonito, it's going to be huge. It's going to be big. Yeah, it's at least a bonito. That red light's just flashing on the top. That's just... That one? Yeah. That means it's on. Off. On. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just switched it on. Can you see what you're filming? There he is. Or is that a shark? Oh, that's shark. Oh. Or is that the fish? Not so. Or is it a shark chasing the fish? Or is it a oh. fish just went stupid? Yeah, there's a shark on the fish. There's a shark on the fish. Oh. No. There is a big. Oh, I can feel it. All right, I'm going to go a bit harder now. No. All right, I'm going a bit harder. I'm going hard. Going harder now. Too hard. <laughs> I saw the shark. Oh, shark's on it. Where's that camera? Elliot. Stick it under the water. Stick it under. Stick it in. 
Yep. I need to point it down. No, Elliot, away from the line. Yeah, Not on the line. Can you see it? Yeah, that's the Keep the camera under. I think that's the shark. Yeah, the fish is there. Get the net ready. Look at the shark. Get the camera under the water. It's a long tail. Yeah. He's exhausted. My arm's exhausted. Oh. oh my god! Oh my god! We just got that! That's awesome! Oh my god! On the floor. No, it's not a meter. It's a I'm waiting for this the shark. Um, that oh that God, shark was right behind it. it. He was right up its backside. Okay, so what are we doing now? That's a beautiful fish. Keep that. We're keeping that for sure. Yeah. Probably not. He's too exhausted to go back. Okay. So we came out here for the boys to have a bit of a fish and catch lots of little fish. And... <laughs> and then we hooked into something a bit bigger. I was, uh, that was a really hard fight because I was jigging quite light gear. And uh, we really hope it shows up in the footage. There was a shark right up its backside. Now we're going to take this fish home um, with us just because the fight was so long. It's getting heavy, my arm's so sore. Um, I don't think the fish will survive if I put him back in. Plus, they're really good eating. So, there we go. Should we go watch some whales now? Keep fishing. No, keep fishing. <laughs> I want to catch one. All right. Even I probably won't be able to do. Okay, so uh, bleed them before you put them on ice. Uh, very important. And then, um, yeah, yeah, sashimi or cook them as steaks or whatever. So that's what we'll be doing. All right, who wants a photo next to the big Me. fish? Yeah. Uh. Folks, we are. Uh, I've managed to drag the kids away from fishing. However, there are fish underneath us, so Liam's going to have a drop. This is going to be really hard to show you on the camera, okay? Because we're we're not allowed to get too close to them. Um, Jen, can you just move, please? Right in front of us is a pot of whales. Um, you can see this whale boat's coming in. This whale boat's coming in. Those recreational boats are sitting back as well. So we've shut off all our motors and that. They're actually heading straight towards us. Um, we saw them breaching before. There they are. Just popped up behind us. They just stay oh. a little play over there. Check out these conditions, folks. What do you reckon, dear? Is the water a bit rough? <laughs> yes, clearly. It's <laughs> tough to take. Hard to take. So Boys, did we have a bit of epic fishing this morning? Yeah. What did you think of it, Elliot? It was great. It was great? The Benito. The Benito were great. What do you reckon, Liam? Yeah, it was pretty good. Pretty Benito good? Hard to find. What do you reckon, dear? About the fishing? Yeah. Oh, I didn't really get a chance to do any fishing. Oh, thank you. Okay. It was just on the go. And then we've come in close to the island. It is beautiful. We are way behind schedule. So what do you reckon, dear? Do we want to go paddleboard and explore or do we? I think that I'm going to still feel a bit shaky on the water after that um, tiger shark encounter. <laughs> I don't know. The tiger shark encounter. Wait until you see the tiger shark footage. What did you think of the tiger shark, boys? Uh, it was cool. I, was, I, was scared. I was scared, but I wanted to. You were scared. But I wanted to fish more. I wanted to give it a high five. You wanted to give it a high five? Yeah. Dad, right. you could have touched it. Ah, righty-o, folks. So I think the original plan was fish, 
Get the boys onto a few fish with the jigs. That turned into how many fish do you think you caught? 30. Five billion. Five billion fish, according to Liam. It was definitely easily 20, maybe 30 fish each for the kids. Um, we then want to see whales. We've achieved that, haven't we, dear? We have. Yep. Uh, and then we were going to go for an explore on the island at one of the creeks, but um, time has got away from us. By the time we get in there, um, there's a change expected this afternoon. We've got a few other things to do. I've got a clean fish now. Yes. So, uh -huh. yeah, yeah. So I think we'll just hang around here, mooch around here, check out these whales for a bit, and then we'll... Um, Head home. What an awesome day! Look at these conditions. Oh, we should have bought lunch. Where's over there?